Hello. Today, we've got some brightly colored shapes laid out. And look, they're all mixed up. I wonder what they we need to do to them. I know. Let's sort them into two different groups. Each of the two groups should be differentiated by the way they're described. A word that describes is an adjective. An adjective can be a color, a shape, a size, or anything that is descriptive. First, let's sort these shapes by color. Red one should go there. The yellow one should go here. Where should these little squares go? Yup, they're the same colors. Where should this square go? Should it go here? No. This square is not red. It's yellow. So, it should go here. And the other big square should go here. Where do you think the little triangle should go? Right. This little triangle goes with the yellows, and this other little triangle should go with the reds. We did it! We sorted by color. Let's do it again, but sorting them by a different adjective. Remember, an adjective is a word that describes. Let's mix these up again. And sort them by shape. The squares should go here. And the triangles should go here. Should this little yellow go here? No. This is a square. It should go here. Is this a triangle? Yes, because it has one, two, three sides. So it goes here. Now the red shapes. What shape is this? Right, a triangle. That means it should go here. Do you see any more triangles? There it is. The little red one. It goes here. These last two shapes are squares. They are squares because they have four equal sides. Where should they go? Right. The left group. They should go here. We did it. We sort everything by shape. Let's do this one last time, this time by another adjective. So let's mix these up again, and let's sort them by size. The small shapes should go here. The large shapes 
should go here. Small is also called little. Large is also called big. A word that means the exact same thing or something similar is called a synonym. Like big and large both mean this size. And little and small both mean this size. Let's sort some more. Should this, this red triangle go here? Yes. It's large and big, just like this yellow square. Should this red square go here? No, it's too big. So it should go here. Where should this yellow triangle go? Do you think it goes here? No way. This is smaller than the other shapes. So it goes here. Where should this other red triangle go? Should it go with the small group or the large group? Right, the small group. It's little like those yellow shapes. Where should this red square go? Little or big? Little, right. Wait a minute. This little red square doesn't want to be with the little group. It wants to be with the big group. But it has to go with the small in order to fit with the group. Because... This square must be the same size as the other shapes. Like this last yellow triangle goes with the big group because it's big like the other shapes. We did it! We sort everything by color, then shape, then size. Now you try sorting your things by different adjectives.